Um, I am off to Carnarvon today. Um, just waiting for the bus now. I'm gonna go to my brother's house to check if his internet's been sorted. Then yeah. off to Carnarvon. Since I'm eating a bit better, we're gonna. I've got a voucher, not a voucher, but like an email. 30% off main meals and table table, so we're gonna treat ourselves. Uh, well, Hemi's in the vets. I had some very good news. Um, we had some RSPCA help, and um, yeah, they've paid £80 of the vet's fees towards the, the ops, so it's brought it down drastically for us, which is brilliant, because you know, the money that I've got right now is to take the girls out on days out, make sure that they have a, a fun summer. So yeah, I'm still a bit itchy today. It looks bad because I'm itching like hell, but I promise you, I haven't got nits or anything. It's just really itchy at the moment. Because you're posted. Yeah, it's the morphine that I take. Uh, my stomach has got better. So, yeah, we're going to go to my brother's house. Then we're going to go to Carnarvon, get some pennies. Show them, show them me, please. Wait. And then we're going to go to Table Table for food. We're going to walk along the front. And we're going to go to that park. And Esme's got a little friend with her today. I'm not going to put her in my videos because I've not had permission off her mother. Um, you know, there's a world of difference between putting someone's pictures, well, putting a picture of someone's daughter on Facebook and tagging them in it, and then, you know, putting them on YouTube. So, yeah. And you just wants to show you something. She's a weirdo. Um, but yeah, awesome. I'm uh, I'm feeling a lot more better recently. Getting a bit more sleep. I slept all night again last night, you Daryl. What time did I fall asleep? It must have been about 11. Yeah, it must have been about half 10, 11. I went to sleep because we went to bed quite early. No, sorry, we didn't. It was about half past 12, quarter to one because we watched Guardians of the Galaxy till 12. But saying that, I slept all night and I had a damn good night's sleep, which makes the world a difference, you guys. It really does. It makes me feel so much more better, so much more healthier. Um, so yeah, nice family days out now. And my, um, oh, what's it called? Oh yeah, my sponsored Macmillan Walk products came through today my t-shirt all my forms and everything so chuffed so if there's anyone there that wants to join us uh we'll probably going on saturday the 23rd of september bear in mind i probably won't be able to walk far you're gonna have to walk slow okay um but yeah i'm really looking forward to doing this because it means a lot to me um and it means and you don't it means a lot to me and it means a lot to my family as well um, you know so please if you want to come by all means please do come it means the world and more the merrier you know I'm hoping to make it quite um, noticeable so yeah so yeah I will probably blog you some more through the day especially when we're by the pier um, but yeah have a good Thursday, people. I know I'm going to. Bye. Hello. I thought I'd do a little blog on the way home. Just keep me occupied. I went, just went and dropped my mate's daughter off. She uh, she came for a sleepover. I think she missed her mum. But hot. She's so adorable. And such a good girl as well. So you know what? I ain't half creepy around this uh, car park. At night, look at that one. It's pitch black with a couple of lights through it. Oh, it's not nice. Ah, oh, they've got a bit of light. These are the wonderful streets of Bangor. I'm not telling you which Bangor. You can probably figure out, if not the people that watch my uh, videos, on YouTube. I'm going to go home in a minute. I'm going to have a bath, a nice what, hot bath, with... Um, Bath by a minute. I got from is it Temptations in town. 
to shop called Temptations and Town. I've just realised I've given out which banger I live in because all you have to do is Google which Temptations is. Dick. Um, but anyway, <laughs> I'm going to go and have that. Have a pan ad. Come down, clean PJs, my new dressing room because I've come freezing. And then tomorrow I'm going to the market to get Ugg boot type slippers. If not, I'll go to, um, what's it called? Shoes down. I'll have a look there. I just hope to God I don't get attacked by a fucking seagull now. I can hear one hovering over me. Fucking scare me, you know. It's bloody cold. Not a cloud in the sky. It's going to be ice cold tonight. But I'm ready for going for a bath with a bath bomb in it. Um, Panad while I have a bath. And then just close my zip. Bloody freezing. And then a cup of tea while I have said bath. Come downstairs, have my fruit and chocolate yoghurt because that's what it's all I've fancied all day. It's fruit and chocolate yoghurt. So I went to Tesco after getting uh, Henry from the vets. Who, Henry, is doing brilliant by the way. He is, um, he's got a cone on his head and he's got an, his ear's been stitched up about, it looks like about 10 times. But he's, they've put a bit of a pad over his ear to stop the blood splattering everywhere. So that's good because last time when he had it done before, it just went everywhere. He literally, well, the gunk that was in his ear, they didn't cover it up in the vet that he went to before. And the ear gunk just went everywhere. It was disgusting. But they've put a pad. He's going back on Saturday. Then the lovely Mindy Moves is going on Sunday. Vets at Pets, or Vets at Home, is getting a substantial... Um, it's going to go dark now because I'm walking through the field by my house and there's no light until you get to the other end. Spooky! Woo! Well, yes, you can tell I'm weird at times. If you haven't figured that out by now, I don't know when you will. But, yeah. On a lighter note, I'm feeling so much more better after them tag tablets Dr. Sean prescribed to me. Um, so much more brilliant. Less, less sick. I'm able to eat more, which is helping me. Um, able to, you know, get by on the days. And eating more means more vitamins inside me, more minerals, more liquid means I'm not dehydrated, so I'm not feeling sick. It all rolls into one, it does, guys. You know, like, I try not to push the condition that I've got cancer I don't like to say, oh, I feel like that because I've got cancer. I feel like this because I've got cancer. I feel like this because I'm not eating. That's the way I see it. You know, not eating at the moment. Maybe my body's gone dehydrated. And one of the symptoms that you get when you're dehydrated is you feel a bit queasy. You feel a bit tired. Your body feels a bit weak. But, yeah, it's uh, feeling much better. Which I suppose is very good. So yeah, I'm going to bring Odin and Candy out for a walk here in a bit. Bloody lovely field. I love it here. We moved here about a year and a half ago. And I wouldn't change it for a world where we live. It's a freaking lovely road. Lovely neighbours. Very f helpful neighbours. And uh, yeah, just lovely neighbours. We've got a next door neighbour. Next to us. I won't say his name. Him, his wife and his little boy live next door to us. And he's bloody brilliant. She brought me food not long ago. I was in love with the food. Oh, there she is, my little Missy Moo in the window. Look. Did you see her? Yeah. Did you see her then? Did I actually show her? She's going to run away now. Look. Hi, Min. Hi, Mindy Moon. She's my princess. That's the one I'm taking to the vets. On Sunday to get her skin sorted out. Oh, and here they are, the cavalry. So I'm home. Woohoo! Let's see if Mr. Ward has made me a panad. Well, as we speak. So I'm now gonna go through. No, Odin. I'm gonna go through and I'm gonna show you our boy. Oh, Hemi Hems. Yeah, 
Are you okay, my baby? Come here. Come see mommy. Come see mommy. He's just glad to see his mum, I think. Right, so I'm home. I'm out. Now I'm going to eat my shameful bag of sweets I got from Tesco. It's outrageous how much they cost. I'm going to cry. Hey, none of these sweets are for you, you greedy buggers. Get off my cooker. Oh, thank you, Mr. Ward. Say hello, Mr. Ward. Hello, Mr. Ward. Good ears, yeah. Only just step through the door and look. Pan had waiting with my name on it, huh? Not only sexy, brilliant. At making pan ads. Daryl? Yeah? I have two hands, both of which are full. I might make this my good night vlog because I genuinely want to go to. Um, can you bring me the table to there, please, babe? Please. Oh, I take it you found my, uh, my fire on full blast. Well, you're sweating. I went out and left the fire on full blast. Thank you, Odin. Get down. Odin, down. Come on, get down. Get down, fathead. I'll move up at least. Oh. So, oh, hello, Min. So this is the next one to go for vet treatment. It's because she's got a poorly leg. They reckon um, she's had it before and it's come back again. But we thought we had it controlled with the stuff that we like bought. We got stinky stuff for her and all stuff like that. But now it just keeps on getting worse. So it's injections and tablets. Yeah, and creams. And she's looking at me like, so you absolute bitch, man. You're going to put a cone on me again. But she can't have cones. So I'm hoping that they've got some kind of... Uh... Here she is, look. Say hi, Minnie Moose. Say hi, beautiful. Oh, beautiful she is. Very rare moment of Mindy staying still for ages and ages. Staring at my... Mindy, did you just sneeze on my hand? Oh, Mindy Moose. Oh, and I just went and grabbed my face. Oh, for fuck's sake. Thank you, Mindy. You can have your spit on your tail. Leave her bum alone, Candy Pert. But yeah, um Oh my little man. I'm sorry, Mindy. Look here he is. Oh little boy. Oh here he is, look. Here he is. Oh my baby. Your mommy's baby. Kiss. Do you know why he wants to be my friend? I gave him half a bag of dreamies earlier. She probably thinks if he's nice to me, he'll get some more dreamies. Is that why you're sat by me, Lola, or is it because I'm not very well? Hmm. Anyway, I'm, uh, I'm going to go. I'm going to make this my good night vlog. So I'm starting to get more sleepy at night and I'm starting to forget to do my nighttime vlog. Oh, I got your hems, it's okay. There we go, there we go. He fell on my leg, so. Here he is, look. You see his little ear? No, Odin, don't be jealous. Look, jealous he is. Look, look. Leave him alone. No, don't lick his ear. I know you're just trying to help him, mate. No, don't lick his ear. No, no, no. Odin. Don't lick his ear. Keep some licking his ear. He's trying to make him better, but, you know. Oh, his ear's bleeding a bit. I know, mate. Oh, then no! Staffies. They are renowned for not listening. Renowned for doing dumb shit like walking into walls. As proved in Daryl's 30th birthday. He's not the smartest of dogs. Two seconds later, what's he do? Walk into a fucking door. <laughs> and eats anything in sight. Never let him lick you. Unless he's had no day where he's got hold of cat shit. He likes to eat cat shit. He's in that kitchen now after something. There's no cat shit in the litter though. I think someone's going to crash out on me now for a bit. Crash out on his mum. He 
just farted as he came over that then, yeah? Oh my god! <laughs> Odin jumped over our, st our stair gate by the kitchen and he farted as he jumped over. You minga! You minga! <laughs> See, he's stupid. Look at him. He's stupid. He's silly. He's silly. No, he's still there with daddy. So yeah, I'm gonna. Leave you, love you and leave you. Ow! Love you and leave you. Oh, for frick's sake. I'm not letting you lick me. I don't know what you've eaten in that cup in the kitchen. I'll kiss you there. No. Oh, no, don't lick my boobs. Get through. Ow. Oh, no, I didn't hear my belly now. You're such a jealous boy. Go see Daddy. Daryl Colin. It's on my body. Darren, go, go see daddy. Mum. Go and see daddy, get cuddles off daddy. So yeah, um, have another good day today. Apart from bloody table table in Carnarvon. I'm not going there again. I'm not putting money in that place again. And if anyone watches this that has got anything to do with that place, today, Thursday the 11th of August, your service, you should be bloody ashamed of yourself. You had four tables in and we were there for two hours. Probably about 20 to 25 minutes of that was eating. The rest was waiting for our bloody food. Disgusting. Especially since we had three children sat at the table with us. You weren't busy. There was a pile of dishes on one side waiting to be taken away. That was stinking. There was a pile on the other side waiting to be taken away. That was stinking. Um, yeah, not good. Not good. Nothing compared to the Bango one. The Bango one is brilliant, isn't it? If I want to go in again, I'll go to the Bango one. Disgusting. It made us late for everything. We went in there at half past two or quarter to two. Was it two o'clock? Yeah, two o'clock it was, yeah? yeah? It was between two and half past two we walked in there. It was about... 10 to 4, 5 to 4, we finally walked out of there. And a group of people got in there, unfortunately. It was for a funeral. So it got a bit rowdy and a bit loud in there, so we took the girls out. You know, my heart goes out to whoever's family member that was. I'm very sorry for your loss. Um, but yeah, we went for a walk around Carnarvon. We went to the card factory. Not the card factory, the factory warehouse. Got myself some new bedding, and we got. I got myself a new dressing gown because I keep on stealing Daryl's. His Jedi one as well. He doesn't know what I'm saying. I love you, Daryl. Yeah, with cheese, please. I'm not making you anything. I said I love you. Oh yeah, yeah, I got that. You twat. He's a kid. I'm marrying him, guys. Look. I'm marrying that man. That obsessed with cheese man. I'm sure I'm sure to God he'd divorce me for cheese if he had a chance of living with cheese. Can you? We're not married yet. <laughs> He's now decided. Oh, oh, hey, oh, oh, bless him. I hate it when my kitty cats are ill, you know. I really do. Some people might say it's weird, but my cats mean the world to me. They're like my little children. You know, I've got four daughters, and they all mean the world to me. And I've got six animals, and they all mean the world to me. They're my babies, aren't they? Are you my baby? Yeah, kiss. Oh, no, not with your ear. There we go. Leave him be. Oh, no, 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 don't look his ear. Don't be jealous either. Andy. Look at my babies. Anyone ever hurts one of my cats, yeah, beware. I will tear you a new asshole. My animals are my babies. Uh -huh. And Andy Asquith, oh, if you ever try to hurt. This one, because I think Andy likes him.
because he's taken a shine to Andy. So if you were ever to try and hurt him, I think Andy would hurt you too. Yeah? Yeah? So I'm going to head off now and I'm going to get gone. In the words of Nana Ann, that's going to be my uh, thing. I'm going to get gone. Thank you, Nana Ann, for that little phrase. We've been thinking about doing a phrase at the end of every single blog and I've been thinking, ciao for now. No, that's kind of cliche. And I thought, what about this? No, what about that? So I'm going to use Nana Ann's thing. I'll get gone. I'm going to get gone. Thank you, Nana Ann. So I'm going to get gone. So you can have a, a bath and go to bed and watch TV in bed. Is it? Yeah. What's all over your face? Uh, What's on your forehead? Is it hair? Uh, have you been putting stuff on your face? No. Yeah, look at the face. Uh, look, was it hair? Oh, it was hair. Are you sweating? No. <laughs> no, she wipes sweat up into her brow. Say hi to the internet. You. <laughs> Aren't you happy? Yay! He loves me. I've just been having kisses. <laughs> Why do I look so jaundiced in this colour here? Yeah, I look so yellow, guys. I'm not like that, you know. <laughs> just, just, I'm, 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 I look so jaundiced. Do you have look you, have, have you oh, shown no, um, t-shirt? Like t-shirt. Oh, I will tomorrow. Mm. Good night, Anya. And also, I'm going up for a bath in a minute, which I do not need you to no. enter. So, if you need a pee pee. Well, when are you doing this? Tomorrow. Huh? tomorrow. It's 10 o'clock tomorrow. Yeah. If you need a pee pee or a poo poo, <laughs> go now. Where's the cream? What cream? <laughs> it's doing the poop it's going to be that bad, is it, Anya? <laughs> it's in our bedroom. I'll bring it through in a minute when I go up. Bye bye. Love you. I'll give you one when I get up, so I'll give you a hug and a kiss. Oh, you're weird. Oh, I look better now. Oh, wait, no, I look orange again. What the fuck? Anyway, I'm going. I'll get gone. I'll speak to you tomorrow. Have a good night's sleep, everyone. And have a good Friday tomorrow. And remember, people, Bangor Market is on tomorrow. Look at me like that. Support your local people.